아, 네, 뼈가 있어. 빅테일? 빅테일? 뭐, 돈, 돈낭이랑 안뽕은 어디세요? 돈낭은 없고요. 무슨? 돈낭은 돈낭 따갑지인데, 그 뒤에. 그래서 조금씩밖에, 하나씩밖에 안 나오는 거예요. 어쩔 수 없어. They don't have testicles. It's okay. Like, this is a heart. A heart? 이거, 이거 뭐예요? Septum. 이거는 오돌 뼈. 오돌 뼈? Yeah. Airway. Airway. This is awful. Pork awful. Basically, a bowl full of Kopegi, the skin, and they also give you these giant leeks, that's a <laughs> pigtail. Oh my gosh, pigtail, I've never had pigtail in soup form or anything. And let's put a little heart on the grill. Is it heart? I think this yeah. is heart, this yeah. is part of the heart. Um, and I don't know what this is, but we're going to put it on. Some kind of intestine? It's gonna be a very, very interesting meal. Look at how big that bowl is. <laughs> Sometimes you find a place so special, so unique, and so mind altering that it changes you forever. Every once in a while, you hear about a restaurant and you know you just have to go there. This is phenomenal. This is a happy place. If I was to rank it from smiley face to frowny face to excited face, this would be excited. excited face. For me, a matchup requires several things. Local food served fresh, unapologetic standards of preparation, and most importantly, a staff that takes genuine pride and interest in making sure you feel welcome in their care. Changun Jip in Cheongju, Korea has all of these qualities. It's genuine, it's a genuine feeling. I wish there was a word for it. A good matjip has to have a good ajima. It has to have a good emo, like a home feeling. And you, you feel like you're a part of her family. Stepping into this matriarchal restaurant is like stepping into a family of aunties and mothers who make damn well sure that you're taken care of and fed well. They serve all the cuts of pork that most other places avoid. Heart, womb, intestine, tail, and cheek can be found on the menu. The rich taste of the pork melds with their special gochujang barbecue sauce. I guess my only takeaway is just, just the amount of fun you have when you have different cuts of pork. When you have something new that you've never had, you just get so excited. Please subscribe if you enjoy learning about amazing food experiences and enjoy the video. So this looks like some gochujang, but it's specially, specially made here. Specially made uh, chogochujang. Chogochujang, okay. And you can see it's boiling. Yeah. I'm gonna taste it a little bit actually. Let's just try it. Mmm, it's really good. Really vinegary, very spicy. Reminds me of a seafood. Reminds me of a seafood chogo chujang. Like melja in Jeju Island. Yeah, yeah, something like that. It's really good though. Garlicky, vinegary, a little sweet. It's mild. It's gonna be nice with the greasy pork, I think. All right. Oh, so beautiful. It sounds so good. <laughs> this is one kilogram? Yeah. One kilogram for 17,000 won. We need some of that makgeolli. Yep. For sure. So here, they also use local makgeolli, the factories around this area. So I'm going to cut up the heart into three pieces. We are, we are actually sad that we don't have testicles. <laughs> We're like, why, are they, why don't we have balls? What about womb? Is the womb in here? Taboo. Is it here? Yeah. Yeah, we have the womb though. Cheers. It tastes clear. Yeah. Yeah, that's really, really good. Um, it's got a little bit of an It's got that aspartame taste, of course, but it's local makgeolli, it's okay eating the pig heart. I'm so excited about this. Have you ever had heart before? Uh, I don't think so. Mm. Yeah, I mean, With the sauce, it's amazing. Let's try it. 
Yeah, really good. Wow. With the sauce is amazing. The sauce is almost like spicy, thick. Oh, that's awesome. This piece is really good. Whatever. I think that was the cheek. The cheek? Yeah. The cheek is one of my favorite cuts, really. Maybe a lump? I have no idea. I think at this point we don't need to know. It's just, I think at this point we should just enjoy the bowl yeah. and just. This one is full stuff. We'll tell everybody yeah. that this is a bowl of off cut meat. This is a bowl of offal. All it is. Sure. We don't know exactly what everything is. It just would be fun to know. I know, just yeah. for us. This is vocal cord. I can see the vocal cord. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This is vocal cord. Yeah, that one. That was probably the easiest. Wait a bit. Like this. <laughs> like this. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Should have done our pork anatomy. You still have these places that are. They're not. They're doing what they should be. It feels natural. It's not like they're preserving anything. This is what it naturally should be like. But it feels like you're in a time machine. And, yeah. It's a little dirty, but the Ajima is so kind. She was lovely. She's so lovely. Yeah. Wow. That pig tail is just brewing over there. It looks really good. I love that you grill leeks here. It's just really unique Korean barbecue. All right, I'm gonna try one with the leek. Gina, you should try some of this it will be a before good it's gone. It's really good. Yeah, Matt and I are eating it all. Wow. Good with the leek? Yeah. That's the best bite. The leek, it's really sweet, actually. Oh, it's sweet? Yeah, it cuts the savory fattiness. It's really yummy. It's a nice crunch too. Another really unique thing about this place is they give you this whole leek and you grill the leek and cut it up and you eat it with the meat. Um, the leeks are really beautiful. It kind of reminds me of grilling asparagus or some vegetable with your meat. Um, don't see this very often in Korean barbecue so it's really, really cool. Alright, I think we should cook the Trachea, maybe? Vocal cords? Wow, it's really, really beautiful, beautiful piece of meat. Here we go, pigtail. It's my first time ever eating pigtail. I'm gonna dip it into this boiling sauce. Mmm, that's really, really nice. <laughs> it's like, it's kind of like jokbao, but you guys are really gonna like it. It's really good. That's the best one so far. Really? Yeah, easily. It's like it's really pig skin with some meat. Yeah, it's a little chewy, but it's a very pleasant chewiness. Like some of the other pieces we've had have been like kind of an unpleasant, crunchy chewiness, which is natural with the kind of meat we're eating. But that tasted really, really nice. I'm excited for you guys to try it. We got one more piece here. Still your favorite? That's my favorite cut so far. Yeah. The flavor is really good. Very porky. It's good. I like it. Let's wash it down with some makgeolli. <sighs> really good. Take the sauce it. off. It's starting to reduce too much. Yeah. It's 
got so many different textures and flavors. It's really enjoyable. We like eating the pork skin. Yeah. We get a little bit of that, a little bit of crunch, plus jokba, like that kind of fatty, rubbery, chewy bit, but it's very, very smooth. It's so good. It's chewy but tender at the same time. Is it your favorite cut so far? Or do you like the cheek more? The cheek is what a lot softer. The, the heart was really good. The heart was really good. It's good. It's porky. Personally, the texture thing, I will take the heart or the tail yeah, over the sure. any day. Gonna go plain, just pure womb. It's good. It just tastes like Nejang. Yeah, nothing special. But it's cool that it's the womb. It's really good. I like Nejang, so it's good. The aftertaste is really bitter. Very interesting. So we have, we ordered Sulguk, and Sulguk is like. Basically, heijangguk. Um, it's a really spicy soup, and the broth is made by boiling bones. Um, is it pork bones? I'm pretty sure it's pork bones. Uh, they boil bones for a really long time, add a lot of gochugaru. It looks like there's a lot of uh, nejang, a lot of the same. Oh, lots of bean sprout. Tons of bean sprouts. Definitely good for hangover. <laughs> and. Yeah, it looks really, really delicious. It's pretty watery. Mm. It actually tastes like a gongnamu guk, but a more flavorful, rich version of that. So is it spicy? It's really spicy. Is it? Really spicy. Gongnamu guk is usually really bland, but this is like if you took gongnamu guk and made it spicy and full of flavor. Soju? Ah, we ordered makgeolli though. Soju? Should we get some soju with it? She's so sweet. This one is ulte. Ulte? Ulte is airway. Airway, for trachea maybe. Yeah. Wow, you can see. When we have different cuts, we look at each single cut and we get excited putting it on the grill. And we're like, oh, what's this gonna taste like? <laughs> sure. And it's fun. Yeah, for sure. I think I'm having more fun just grilling up different cuts than I am. I, 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 no, I like I, the taste I, I get, too. No, I agree with you. Yeah. It's just really fun. I'm having a great time. And it brings the joy back into barbecue. If you've lost that joy, try something like this. It's a genuine feeling. I wish there was a word for it. But for, you know, I always say like a good matchup has to have a good ajima. It has to have a good emo, like a home feeling. When, when you go to your grandma's house, grandma takes care of you. Exactly. And you feel and, that here. And you, you feel like you're a part of her family. For me, the food could taste like shit. I would still come here. For the atmosphere and the ajima. Yeah. Luckily, the food is really it's good. Super good. So, it's a winning combination. Look at that. Look at the juices just wow. coming out. Woo. I just can't get over this kimchi. Oh, oh shit! Oh, 
Oh, you scared me. <laughs> Did you get that on Whoa, camera? Whoa, <laughs> So Gimnejip, this place we're at, is one of the original Budejige restaurants. It used to be called Twenejip. Uh, now Twenejip moved to a bigger location because they were successful, but this is their original location. Budejige was illegal for a long time. It was actually illegal when this restaurant opened. Back then, they had to smuggle the 